Um, I'm going to limit this because I don't want to list like six or seven people and have some people watch this and go, oh, what the hell, you, you, didn't, you didn't mention me. Um, I, I'll, I think about the three amigos as uh, Russ Clark and Mike Harvey and I used to be referred to by our, our students. Um, when I first got out here, Russ Clark uh, was the department chair. He was right next door to me. I was in C14, which is now 8059 or something. I still haven't learned our new number uh, system. Uh, he was in C16. I had Elaine Conley to my right. John White was right across the way. Uh, Russ and I hit it off right away. Um, I was alone my first year. I was engaged, but my, uh, my wife Jennifer was finishing up her education also at Minnesota. And so Russ kind of took me in and we just, uh, we had a lot of, we had a similar sense of humor. And um, I would go over to his house for dinner and to wash my laundry and to play with his baby girl. And uh, I learned a lot from him. He's one of the smartest people I've ever known. Um, and we started doing some hikes together. We, we tackled some pretty big peaks actually together. He got me into mountain hiking and uh, he got me interested in motorcycles. I would never have uh, bought a motorcycle if it hadn't been for him. And uh, Mike Harvey uh, is, uh, here's what I'll say about Mike. I could say a lot about Mike. Um, I haven't spoken with Mike since probably last June. When the Stanley Cup playoffs start up again in April, he and I will talk on the phone pretty much every night for the six weeks of the duration of the NHL playoffs because he's into hockey and I grew up around hockey and and so uh, but both with Russ and who I still hike with from time to time I don't see or talk to either of them all that often but when I do we just kind of pick up where we left off um, I uh, this is an English department but I wanted to get this in your uh, advisor Mr. Carlotti was one of the first people I met when I first came out here um, I was going to be the girls' JV basketball coach, and I had met Ivan Diaz, who's out in Santa Maria now. And everybody was so welcoming and so friendly, and Ivan and I hit it off right away, and he was coaching, so he brought me into the, the coaching room. And Pat was there, and Ned was there, and Izell and the whole crew, and, and I felt very welcomed very early. And I, I distinctly remember uh, Pat. Uh, extending his hand and smiling and engaging me in conversation and I, I felt welcome right from the first day I was here.